they, uh, uh, what do they say? Because he is spouse. Anyway, they changed the word of spouse, married. God married you anyway, Jewish people, even though he knows you broke his commandments, many of you, if not all, at one time or another. He said, but I married you anyway. They changed his spouse. Now they make it sound like he went against them and came to the Gentile. It, yeah, it's just, you know, nobody could verify the book of Matthew. When he's saying prophecy to fulfill, nobody had the scrolls of the Hebrew Bible except maybe the elite and rich. You know, there's no scroll bookstore <laughs> or anything like that. For all anybody knows, with all the excavations that have been done in Israel, they've never unearthed the school. They, they, best they know. No schools. A society of illiterates. Okay, and here it is. Let me get it to you. And again, you have to combine three books for this. This is from Zechariah 9, 9, and 10 from the Hebrew Bible. Rejoice greatly, fair Zion, raise a shout. Fair Jerusalem, lo, your king is coming to you. He is victorious, triumphant, humble, riding on an ass. This is the only prophet that mentions riding on an ass. On a donkey, fold, 